Hello, beautiful people. You are welcome to New Face Entertainment. Yeah, we have um, two interesting news for you. The first one, which is, well, it may be the first or the second one, but one of them is about uh, Lacon's people, a state indigenous. Remember lately that Lacon was recognized by his state government. The indigenous are now replying. They are reacting to it. Then the second one hmm, has to do with uh, the main issue, the ASU strike. How a senator get stood up and was talking like you know our senators. We'll get to that when we get to that to that level. So if this is your first time of coming to this channel, please kindly click on the red subscribe button as well as the notification bell so as to get updated anytime we upload any new interesting video. Thank you. You are welcome. So, uh, you remember lately that uh, Late Kong was recognized by the Ogun State Governor and was made the Ambassador uh, of Youth Development and was also given 5 million. 5 million Naira and uh, house, 3 bedroom, aha, bungalow that was given to Late Kong. All of this in PayPal, nothing has been made real, you know, politicians and all that. If tomorrow, uh, what is, is in our state governor, even the one that federal government has even promised those guys that will go to play football and win uh, international cup for Nigeria. At the end of the day, you start, you now be hearing stories about how the promise that the government didn't fulfill that promise. So, and I don't know why the people of Ogun State now they have valid reasons. Some of them have come out to 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 say how ought they are. At uh, first, a lot of them came out. Uh, let me should I read? Yeah, let me read them. Um, uh, one said, with all sincerity, sir, we do not have a governor in Ogun State. Roads are bad. Schools are in bad shape. Youth are, root are restless because of unemployment and citizens didn't feel any impact palliative during COVID-19. Yet, Mr. Governor is busy sharing our taxes to BB Niger winner. Mm. That cause, <laughs> well, uh, personally, the the whole thing about people coming to react when um, the governor started giving money to Lacon, I, I I don't buy that idea. I don't buy that idea. You see, sometimes when they say your village people, your your village people follow you, <laughs> now bad luck be that. Please. Is it when the governor just gave five million? How much is five million and that three bungalow? That three bedroom bungalow, how much is it? Will it be is it going to be furnished? No. If that three bedroom is um situated or uh, in Ogun State, it can be worth more than forty or fifty million, depending on the statistic and every other thing attached to to the to the house which i'm sure will not be will not even be furnished so what are we talking in all year how much 50 million at most how much is 50 million compared to the issue on ground if you have issue with your governor face your issue with your governor after please all, sincerely, I'm from that state as please well, subscribe. so please I, I, I subscribe. wouldn't subscribe. support Share people this coming video. out to subscribe come to this channel. Tell your friends to subscribe as to this they channel. stick to um, talk about the governance. Talk about the governance on a clear level, please. I these village people, I don't even understand them. So, uh, what do you think, you guys? What do you think? Is this an avenue for them to come out and start saying they don't have a governor, the road is bad, school is this, school is in bad shape, youth are restless? Of course, he was made the youth ambassador for development or whatever. So, maybe he would do something with the five million. You, should, you guys should come out and be begging him that this is what is happening. Please help us if the governor is not going to, governor is not doing anything. You should be happy. 
when you see something of joy, people should come out and be happy. I know there are so many complaints too. You know, people talking about graduates not having job, that, that this is a misplaced priority. Even the retirees came out because like uh, of uh, lately, some weeks back, months back, they came out and they were complaining that they have not been paid their money and they just after working for years and years upon years but we all know that sometimes life is not life is not fair sincerely life is not fair you know imagine somebody that after he has already won gift over 100 million the state governor still gives him more but what the people should just do is to whom more is given, much is expected. I don't support this attack. People coming to be talking about this. Why the governor just gave? It's a celebrity. So I think if you have any grievance with the governance, go use the appropriate channel. You can use him. You can talk to him. Look at the way. Uh, what's it called? A uh, whiskey. Uh, was was attacking the the president, uh, my president Muhammadu Buhari, about the end end of SARS and uh, the police brutality. He came out. So um, after all, uh, Whiskey is also from this same state, Ogun State. So if you have people like that, let them come out. Let them come out and speak for you. Let them come out. They, these are the people that are, that the governors will pretend they are listening to or will listen to when they see that it is coming out from them. But you now coming out to be complaining, to be like Bad Bele. Bad Bele, I beg, let's go to the next um, story. It's about this senator. <laughs> the senator stood up and was saying that the asu like somebody that entered school at 1819 that was supposed to spend like four years which is just still like 23 24 year old when the person now wants to apply for work they will now say that the person should not be more than 50 uh, 25 years old that how come when you have held that person for six years that how come i'm just asking is what kind of question is that and he said yeah you want the people to now the applicants to be lying first who started the lie you guys the politician oh guys please okay uh, i'm sorry to say that guys who do you think who started the lie the politicians for me is the politicians that started this lie you will come during the campaign. You will lie for us. When you enter, you will be lying for us. There is no money. This is bad. This is that. You will lie so till four years. Another term. Another term. Another term. Another term. Since the year 1999 up to the year 2020. How many years of democracy? 21 solid years. And we, you see, before then, oh, before then, because before democracy, they've been always been strike, 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 strike. And in fact, immediately we even got some democracy. Some schools began to be known for perpetual strikes. Schools like, <laughs> don't let me mention names, those that have been in school, like they know, like for the past 20 years, some schools have been known for strikes. So once you just choose that school, any of those schools, you know that your four year course will amount to seven or eight years course sincerely so but i would just like us to listen to this um senator listen and you will hear how he is just trying to i don't know they're just trying to mess themselves up but i know people will listen to them and say yes let them let the absolute strike let the lecturers let them return back to school they will be doing this they'll be doing that let us talk to where the matter is that is not the matter. This man that is saying whatever he's saying now, they are the people that... Because if the lecturers and everything is being met, why would they want to disturb the... What, what benefit is, are they going to get? They want to be struggling with the government, the government to give them what they know that the government cannot give them or what they are not... Um, not entitled to what they are supposed to be given. Because it's not an entitlement that these guys are asking for.
for crying out loud so please just watch the video and you too so that you you too you will enjoy <laughs> or you'll be able to analyze the video yourself and don't forget to leave your comment in the comment section leave the comment for Lacon and also the comment for this video that is going to play now a four-year program become six seven years a child can go into the university at the age of 18 19 they have the hope of graduating at 22, 23, graduate at 26, 27. When he's applying for a job, he will be told that if you are beyond 25 years, don't apply. What kind of wickedness is that? You kept him in school beyond what is necessary, and you now begin to teach them to lie.